Welcome to the VeritasProject.org. Today I'm going to be showing you that the website works on your smartphone just as well as on your desktop browser. What you're looking at is the way the website formats automatically for your smartphone, whether that be a Blackberry, an iPhone, or one of the many Android devices. As you'll notice, you can scroll all the way through. You see all welcome statements. The update news from the Vatican News Portal, Vatican Information Service, the USCCB Media Blog, and what other people are saying about us, like Lisa Hindi from CatholicMom.com. Uh, you can watch a video from Live on the Air from KNXT TV, our local Diocese of Fresno Catholic television station. Our special thanks, and of course, our donating policy. Again, we do not accept donations or sponsorships. We are self-supporting, and we ask people who come to our site to prayerfully consider donating to their local diocese schools or to Peter's Pence. Going back up, next to the title of our website, you'll notice a menu button. By clicking on the menu button, you'll come up with a list of choices. Now, one of the things I want to show on how to be using the mobile site for today is for all those fellow Catholics who like evangelization and apologetics. And our site is definitely geared towards this. By going down to the catechesis section, just click on that, and then you'll notice the beliefs. From here, if you press on the beliefs, a new menu will show up. From here, you can select a whole different amount of topics. To look from. Of course, a lot of times when you're evangelizing or performing apologetics, you're going to be talking about the seven sacraments. It's almost inevitable it comes up. From here, you clicking on the seven sacraments menu, you have the option of looking at the seven sacraments, just like you would on the desktop model, but in this form, you can see its touch interface, and you can see scripture and early church fathers. So, let's try confirmation with the early church fathers. And then you're going to click on that to confirm it. And then you'll also notice that we still have the Google Translate tool available, so it can be translated into different languages if you're a, a non-native English speaker, or if it's easier for the uh, other person that you're speaking with to read in a different language. And by scrolling down the page, you'll notice the quote from the early church father, say this first one, by Augustine. And then, again, you can always tap on the early church father's name, and it will take you to the Catholic Encyclopedia's uh, article entry on that early church father. Or at the bottom of the quotation, you can click on uh, the citation, and it will take you to that work by that early church father on the newadvent.org. Catholic Encyclopedia website. Something else that's neat on all of these pages that deal with the seven sacraments and some of our other pages too, is you'll notice that once you go through the list of the different uh, quotations, citations, you'll notice that we also provide links, additional links to help you with this. There's uh, a link here to the St. Charles Borromeo uh, Church's uh, mobile catechism site, and also direct links to the Catechism of the Catholic Church listed on the U.S. Catholic Conference of Bishops website, and then also pertinent links to the Code of Canon Law on the Vatican's website, and then to help explicate your position a little bit more, links to uh, the Catholic Encyclopedia at new, newadvent.org on topics related to the main topic of the page. And then you can always click on your back button to get back to the home page. And again, by clicking on the menu button found at the top of the home page and all the other pages will bring up the different sections. So you can always go to resources and check out all the different links to the different resources that are uh, provided here on the website.